guys. Welcome back to my channel. I'm Deborah from Time with Joel by Deborah. I have been an online seller since 2005. If you're new, welcome to my regular subscribers. Okay, so I got seven boxes all sent from Mechanicsburg. They're all labeled, so I started at DIYD. These are the designer boxes, and I'm going to go in order. So this is the first one they sent to me. And uh, I'm hoping for a score. Hope everyone's doing well. I ordered these on October 8th. Okay. Please be some good Gucci. I see shoes. Okay, here's the first look. Big money, no whammy, right? Some of you might know what that is. All right, the first piece is Teeny Tiny, St. John Collection. Here's the label. It's really pretty. It's a size 10, it's silk. Red, beige. Something in here smells like perfume. Pretty, oh, okay, this is the front. Pretty, silk. All right, so number one, not heavy on clothes today. So hopefully the shoes are good because I can see there's a lot. Okay, this one is Burberry Brit, size medium. Here's the label. It needs definitely a cleaning. It is really filthy here on the neckline. Polka dot, that's kind of a cute little binding on the back. Okay. It looks okay. We'll definitely have to give that a good check over. Here is, that's pretty, a blue, blueberry Brit placard. It doesn't look like it has any stains. That's the first time I've gotten the Burberry Brit. All right, please be good. All right, we've got a honker of a Marc Jacobs. Ugh. It's in piss poor condition here. You can see it's like eaten right here, but this purse is heavy. So yeah, it's, it definitely has been eaten away there and down here. It's a pretty forest green. Wow, this thing is heavy. The inside is all suede. Wow. Here's the label from inside. Wow, it's that big. Let's see here. Heavy. Got to check and make sure that all of the pockets work. There is a little bit of wear here to the metal. So that I will definitely need to clean up. But yeah, wow. I seriously don't know how heavy this bag is, but I like big bags, but I don't know if I could carry this one. So that's number three. Oh, there is another piece of clothes stuck down in the bottom. Looks to be navy blue or black, maybe. It is a Brunelli Cuccinelli. Here's the label. It's like a t-shirt material. Dress, teeny tiny, wow. With the gather here on the side, it looks like it's silk lined. And it's a faux turtleneck. No price, or no, no size tag. But I did notice on the back that there is some trim loss here, accent loss. But that's okay. Most people won't see that. So interesting. Let's see what material this is. If we can find the material label. But yeah, the inside sure does feel like silk. I hope you're all having a good day. It is rainy and fall weather here in the Chicago suburbs. Okay, I do not see one. But this is a dress. It looks like it's in otherwise good condition. All right, I'm going to open that last thing last because I'm not sure what that is. Okay, we got a pair of Dior shoes with their signature print. Big wedge. Brown. There's, let's see, they are size 37 and a half. 
They do have a lot of wear here and on the toes. But structurally, it looks okay. Let's see how the other one is. Let's see. I need to check and make sure. Yep. They look intact. So, yeah, the most wear is right here on the toes. Otherwise, they're pretty clean. The bottoms are worn. They're a very heavy shoe. They're not bad. All right. <clears throat> Saint Laurent Paris. Black. Big old heel. Let's see how big this heel is. I always keep my, my measuring tape on a carabiner. Right, so I have one next to my desk. It is a four inch heel. The bottoms don't look bad. Pretty with these accent. It's studded. You can feel that. They need a good cleaning. Let's see if the other one looks as good. It definitely needs a polishing and a cleaning, but these are great. All right, and the last item, I'm hoping are sunglasses, and I'm hoping they're not in bad condition. So, let's see what we got. So, are you guys getting ready for the holidays? I am, for sure, starting early this year. All right, so... Cute, whatever they are. They look like they're Chanel. Yes, it's marked Chanel right here. Right on the side. Made in Italy. They are filthy. They're pretty, though. I really like that. They're like a blue and a tortoise shell color. So hopefully they're not all scratched up. Because they are cute. Oh, boy. They are scratched up. Yeah. This would drive me nuts. So, they are cute, though. Too bad. They can't be repaired. So, hmm. Not starting out with the best box, but I've got six more to go. So, that was the one. The sunglasses that have been chewed up. The Dior's are in good condition. And the St. Laurent are the 37 and a half. These are in great condition. The dress is in good condition. This is also in good condition. This is the other Burberry. And then this is really pretty. I really like this. And this one was the St. John collection. And then the last was a huge heavy Marc Jacobs bag. So yeah, there's too much wear. I mean, it is soft and supple, that is for sure. It's a very beautiful bag. I love that color. Perfect for fall. So I will definitely give that a rub down. And uh, it is definitely sellable. So most of the items in here are sellable. I think the sunglasses are the only thing that are a wash. But otherwise, not too shabby. So I'll be back with box two soon. Talk to you guys later. Have a good one and be well. Bye.